Attention, Jesus is really coming back soon, everybody. This is not a joke. This is not a game. This is this is real life. Like I just had a dream of me. I was in my old street um, in in Connecticut, and I went inside my old church building that I used to go to when I was a child, you know, up until I was a teenager. It was a it was a Baptist church. And when I opened the door, I felt like, it felt like, like a presence, like a dark kind of presence. And I looked across the pews uh, all the way up into the front of the church. And like, there was a big mirror at, at, at like the front and what had happened was like there was lights in the mirror and the lights had like fire like like and it was dark like the light like the like the mirror reflected like I don't know what it reflected but all I know is in that mirror I saw people on fire in darkness but like they couldn't move like they would they just stared blankly at the mirror while like i turned around and people were like talking and you know in church having fun and and you know and I, I, it got me thinking like dude what fam got like everyone please i beg of you I, I don't know why God showed, God showed me this dream to wake not only me up, but to wake you all up. Like, the lukewarmity is sickening. We can't love God during, like, one day of the week and then deny Him the rest. We can't. He's really coming back. And when he comes for his bride, if we are not there, it's like, it's, it's not going to be pretty. If, he, if we are not taken up, when he comes back, it's not going to be good. So please, I beg of you, if you have not given your life over to the Lord Jesus Christ, I beg you to do so. Please, it, it this is this is a matter of life. It's not, not even I'm of life and death. It's it's something way more serious than that. Like Jesus Christ died for our sins because we cannot pay them on our own. No matter what we do, we can't we we can't uh, we can't please God by our good deeds at all. We will be found wanting, and we will suffer eternal damnation in hell. We need Jesus Christ, the God Man who died on the cross for our sins, who paid that the, the penalty for our sins, and rose in the third day, and is coming back again to reclaim what is rightfully His. He's going he's coming back to destroy this world and all those who defile it and destroy it. Which is and and he's he's not playing around. Like the lukewarmity is is sickening. He's at the door, everybody. Please make the right choice. And I'm speaking to myself when I say this. Make the right choice. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen.